Hi guys, so today I'm going to be doing a natural or no makeup makeup look. So it's basically a makeup look that looks like you're not really wearing makeup, it more looks like it's your natural beauty and natural glow that's shining through. And it's actually this makeup look I'm wearing right now. So if you guys are interested in seeing how I did this, please go ahead and keep watching and I'll show you exactly what I did. And I'm going to use the Sean Takai Tinted Moisturizer. Just put some of that on my hand. And then from there, I'll just kind of put it where I want it to be. This tinted moisturizer is, I would say, a pretty good coverage tinted moisturizer. It's lighter than a foundation, but definitely heavier than most tinted moisturizers you have out there. So the reason why I like this is it does give me a little bit of coverage for any blemishes that I have. But it's not heavy in any way, shape, or form, and it really lets your natural skin kind of shine through. So... I'm going to go ahead and take a Real Techniques Expert Face Brush and then just blend that in. And I'm using the color Nude in this tinted moisturizer. And just buff that into the skin. So the next thing I want to focus on is my eyebrows. So I definitely want to keep this very natural. I'm going to use the Anastasia Brow Wiz pencil to just kind of slightly, first of all I'm going to brush out my, my brows and then slightly just fill in where there are any kind of sparseness. Like right here you'll see there's a little bit of sparseness, but I'm not going to be overly defining them. I'm literally just going to be filling them in just so they're not as noticeable I feel like as they are now. So nothing too extreme, just slight little strokes. Once I've done that, go back through and just brush out what I've done, just so it's even more natural looking. So even though this is a natural makeup look, I want to make my skin look like it does have a little bit of a glow to it, a little bit of sun to it. So I'm going to bronze up my skin. I'm going to use the Hula Bronzer by Benefit. I'm just going to take a Real Techniques powder face brush, tap in there, and literally just go kind of all over my T-zone and slightly over my cheekbones. And this is going to be nothing extreme at all just because we're not trying to get any type of definition at all. Just add a little bit more color to our skin. Sorry, my strap keeps coming down. Now for the eyes, I don't really want to put too much color because again, this is a natural or no makeup makeup look. I'm going to take my Naked palette and I'm going to take the color Sin, which is this color right here. And this will just give my eyes just a little bit more of a kind of glow, but nothing that's going to stand out at all. Now to brighten my eyes up a little bit more, I'm going to use my Maybelline Age Rewind Concealer right underneath my eyes and just do a little bit. I'm not going to do anything too extreme just to kind of cover up any kind of darkness there might be underneath there. Get my expert face brush and then just kind of pat it in. To add a little extra glow to my cheeks, I'm going to use the, I think it's TIGITG um, blush in the color Lovely. I'm just going to take a blush brush, put it in there, and then tuck in my cheekbones and slightly go like this. Oh, sweep it up. I don't need any, The thing I like about this is it's not too pigmented of a blush, so if you're going for more of a natural look, it will just give you kind of that glow rather than bam, you got blush on. If you do happen to go overboard on your blush or on your bronzer, just take your foundation brush again and just kind of go over the area and it will kind of blend it out a little bit. Now my favorite natural mascara, looking mascara, is the Their Real Benefit Mascara. That's what I'm going to use today. I'm just going to apply this, a couple coats, to my lashes. And I kind of work in way and then kind of come out. And I also like to apply it to my bottom lashes too. I know this is a natural look, but this mascara is very easy to pull off. 
the natural look. And it doesn't clump up your lashes too much, so on the bottom lashes, they look fine. And the final part of this video is going to be the lipstick. And I'm going to use this NARS Dolce Vita. I'm just going to apply that to my lips without any lip liner. And then I'm going to take my finger and just kind of rub it in a little bit. This will make it look less of a lipstick and more like your natural lip color. And I'll slightly mute the color as well. And I did say that last step was the last step, but this last step for real is optional if you want it. Um, and it is to apply a setting powder. I'm going to use the Rimmel Stay Matte powder. Just swirl it around with the face brush and then just kind of apply it right to my T-zone just so it kind of locks the makeup in place number one and does not make me look too shiny. This is my natural makeup, my no makeup makeup look and yeah, it was pretty simple, pretty easy, very, very quick to do, very easy to do for every day. And if you guys have any questions, please go ahead and put them in the bottom bar below and I will get to those as soon as possible. But thank you guys so much for watching. I will see you next time.